coming to frailty it is defined as the increased vulnerability of the patient to physiological stress surgery is one form of a physiological stress to the patient and whether elderly patient will be able to cope up with the stress and frailty is associated with adverse health outcome after medical and surgical intervention it limits the life expectancy and there are two primary models for frailty one is the frailty phenotype another is the deficit accumulation model in the phenotypic frailty you look at the weight loss energy low physical activity slow walking speed and low muscle strength this is uh, described by freed and uh, colleagues and it is based on the identification of trait associated with occurrence of the disease hospitalization falls disability and death here it is defined as a determinant of frailty as weight loss exhaustion physical activity walk type and grip strength coming to deficit accumulation frailty here you look at cognition nutrition mental health physical function and morbidity this deficit accumulation model of aging is based on data from canadian study of health and aging they identified signs symptoms functional impairment and laboratory abnormalities that are proportionally weighted into a frailty index for predicting mortality coming to edmonton frail scale here they have nine criteria cognitive general health functional independence social support used medication nutrition mood disorder of the patient continence and functional performance another important thing which you look in the elderly patient is the charlson comorbidity index where you look at the 12 variables which are various comorbidities which can be present and weightage can be given to certain disease for example there is hemiplegia or kidney disease or a leukemia lymphoma it is given 2 point coming to summarizing the frailty test mini cognitive score of 3 or less serum albumin less than 30 g per liter or one or more falls in prior 6 months and hematocrit less than 30% or all associated with poor frailty time up and go test 15 or more seconds activities of daily living dependence and charlson comorbidity index score greater than 3 or more is also associated with increased frailty the edmonton frail score can be administered by an individual with no formal education and has been validated in comparison to geriatric specialist comprehensive geriatric assessment